Good afternoon children and welcome to the digital technology lesson for today. Today we are talking about sports scores and how our information systems are constantly keeping people updated with real time live scores. Today there are multiple information and ICT systems that keep us in touch and help us find out the latest sports scores of our favourite teams. These include Twitter. Twitter gives you short updates and usually a link to a sports website. Facebook. This gives you what Twitter does, plus people can post a lot more information including commenting on different walls. Sports websites. Websites such as sportal.com.au are dedicated to solely reporting on everything to do with sports. And TV. Live sports are on TV nowadays 24-7. These developed and complex solutions and information systems meet personal, community and sometimes school needs. But how can we use information systems better in the classroom and school environment? And what do we do at school which needs these systems of information systems? Gunadara Primary School, for example, is in a small rural town 200 kilometres north of Melbourne. There is a current problem there with the absenteeism of students and this is causing them to fall behind in the class curriculum. Their information systems there are pretty minimal. So what do you think they can do? There are two potential solutions to their problems. E-learning and online classes. E-learning enables the school to have another way in which to teach their students. Through this approach, the students can use their own login details and access the learning materials they need online through the school intranet. This means that even if they are absent from the classroom, they can still access the lessons in their own time. Online classes are an excellent idea to combat absenteeism. They work well in rural schooling environments. Here, Gunadara can set up a video camera in the classroom and this records the entire lesson. Students can then use the same login details as they did before and as they watch the video, they are able to learn and feel like they are a part of the class even though they are not there. Both of these options not only address school needs but rural community needs and individual student needs. How do you think you can use information systems to improve what you and fellow students do in the classroom? Gunadara Primary School ended up creating e-learning and online classes for their students. They quickly found it was very beneficial and showed the following benefits. They got a higher student attendance rate due to online and in-class lessons. Absenteeism was therefore cut by 20%. There was an increased student motivation in the school and a higher level of collaborative learning due to additional online resources accessed through the Australian curriculum. So I hope today has been very clear for you that in today's world, using information systems in a school environment can be very beneficial. Finally, I want to leave with some parting questions to consider. In what ways do you think technology has made your life better and how can you assist others with it? Created using Powtoon.